of Management and Budget, the Office of Science and Technology Policy, and the Department of Just what the heck the natural accounting, capital accounting and ECOS. All right, the, uh, the chair now recognizes himself for five minutes. Uh, Mr. Wachowski, I know you've answered a lot of what I'm going to ask you because I've heard it throughout your testimony, but I just want to go through it again just so that I get it on my record as, as what we're doing. And, uh, and I've spent some time uh, reviewing the, uh, the national strategy to develop statistics for environmental, economic decisions, and natural capital accounting. Uh, since you referenced it throughout your testimony, um, you are familiar with this document, the National Strategy for Natural Ca uh, Capital Accounting, correct? Uh, it uh, although the Bureau was not directly involved in its development and preparation for this hearing, well, I, mean, I, I familiarized myself, certainly. You say yes. Yes, okay. certainly. Okay. Now, according to the strategy itself and information from the White House, the lead authors of the National Strategy for Natural Capital Accounting are the Office of, of Management and Budget, the Office of Science and Technology Policy, and the Department of Commerce. Uh, is that your understanding as well? That is my understanding, Mr. Chairman. Okay. So uh, as the uh, sole representative over there for the, uh, for the Biden administration, uh, can you explain to me why the OMB, OST, and Commerce all refused to come here today to discuss their work and explain to the American people just what the heck the natural accounting, capital accounting and ecosystem service uh, valuation is all about? Uh, Congressman, I, I can say that the Department of the Interior does its best to accommodate uh, witness requests from the committee at, at every opportunity, and I'm, I'm pleased to be here today to talk about the work we're doing at the BLM. Let me just ask you point blank then. Uh, why are OMB, OSTP, and Commerce refusing to testify in front of Congress on this important issue? Again, Congressman, uh, I can only speak for the Department of the Interior that uh, I know the department does its best to accommodate witness requests from the committee, and I'm, I'm pleased to be here today so, to speak about so do the you work think at BLM. So do you think it's fair that uh, OMB, OSTP, Commerce, and, and frankly, the White House uh, just left you here all alone, stranded on that island over there, uh, just to answer questions about uh, a national strategy document that were authored by other agencies? Do you think that's fair? Congressman, again, I, I really can only speak to the department. I know that at the Department of the Interior, um, we do our best to accommodate uh, witness requests from the committee at every opportunity. So you think it's fair uh, OMB and OSTP authored a strategy and issued directives on how the Department of in Interior and the Bureau of Land Management should implement the strategy, but then left you here uh, to answer all the questions about their strategy and the directives. Do you think that's fair? Congressman, again, I really can only speak to the Department of the Interior's uh, considerations for witnesses. But, Listen, uh, man, I'll I tell you what, I'll, I'll answer it for you. No, it's not fair. It's absolutely a shame that the Biden administration left you here all by yourself to answer the questions about a major national strategy that was written by three other agencies who refused to testify in front of Congress here today. And I'll tell you what, um, we may have different views on policies and politics, but, uh, but I kind of feel bad for you sitting over there with the OMB and the OSTP and, and the White House tossing you out here to the wolves uh, alone while they, they don't show up. And uh, I don't blame you. If you decide to leave the Biden administration, call me. We'll help you, we'll help you get a job somewhere. But uh, let, me, uh, let me just finish by saying this. Um, it's absolutely outrageous that the uh, Office of Management and Budget, the Office of Science and Technology and Policy, the Department of Commerce, and the White House sent you here today by yourself to answer for stuff that they've done. Uh, but it's not surprising. I mean, it, it's, it speaks volumes. And uh, it's complete lack of accountability from this administration. And, and as we know from the elderly man with poor memory in the White House, all the way down, that the Biden administration doesn't like getting questions. But uh, we're going to keep asking questions. We're going to keep getting answers, whether President Biden likes it or not. And with that, I, uh, I yield back. And uh, seeing no other members asking questions, Mr. Uh, since you referenced it throughout your testimony, um, you are familiar. All right, the, uh, the chair now recognizes himself for five minutes. Uh, Mr. Wachowski, I know you've answered 
a lot of what I'm going to ask you because I've heard it throughout your testimony, but I just want to get an old strategy for natural capital accounting or the Office of to the Strategy itself and information from the White House, the lead authors of the national, with this document, the National Strategy for Natural Ca uh, Capital Accounting, correct? Uh, I, although the Bureau was not directly involved in its development and preparation for this hearing. Just what the heck the natural accounting, capital accounting and ecosystem.